drop. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Ooh. And as you guys can see, I am holding a fresh cup of tea and I am so excited because you guys already know what month it is. It is the month of October and I have more Sips By Teas. So I have more of these to show you. And if you're not familiar, Sips By is a monthly tea subscription company where they send out four packets for four different companies from all over the world. They send their teas and I get an opportunity to try each one and see which one I like the most. So the cost of this is only $15 a month and if you use my coupon code, I will have it right here on the screen, you can get $5 off of your first box and you cannot beat that. So let's go ahead and get started. And of course, it always lets you know which month of tea that you're receiving. And on the back, it has made for Jennifer, so you'll have your name on there. And each of the companies are listed here for the teas that I'm trying and also details about those different teas. So, so the first one here is from Talira, the Galaxy of Teas. I like it. Cute but simple. So there it is. I like it coming in a cute little satin bag there. So the next one here is from Stash, and this is the Sweet Honeydew and Melon Meal Sucre. This sounds so delicious. There you go. The next one that I have here is the Organic Everyday Detox, and this is Shasandra Berry, and this supports liver function. Mm, I'm pretty sure that's really good as well. So this one is from Snarky Tea. <laughs> so this is Snarky Tea Energize. It says move it or lose it. And this is a really good one. I'm gonna be so excited about trying because it supports energy with Yerba Mate and Matcha. Wait a minute. Oh, that's strong. It's strong. I'm smelling really strong. Yeah, you can definitely smell the turmeric and the cinnamon getting ready to taste test all of these and give you guys my opinion of the best one that I received in this October unboxing. So first one is the Snarky Tea. This is the one that's highly caffeinated and it supports energy. And see if you guys can see into my cup. Pretty. Surprisingly not bad. I, I'm telling you, I had fears. I didn't know if this was going to be gross, but it's actually good. You can definitely taste the cinnamon. You can taste the ginger, and it is. I'm glad because it's overpowering that turmeric. The next one is the Everyday Detox one, and this is the one that is caffeine free. This one looks like a like a berry color. It's not black. It may come off that way on the camera, but it's actually. It actually looks more red, especially when you first start making it. Let me see if I can pull it out and that'll make the difference. See, it has more of a berry look to it. And here we go. No, not for me. That tastes like a a really hot cranberry juice. No. So this one, uh, Stash. I can't remember if Stash was, oh, Stash is low caffeinated. So this is the one from Stash. <laughs> so Stash is a green tea. And when I tip it over, it, yeah, you can see. It's definitely a green tea. And it smells good. Like I said before, it just gives me the, it gives me the smell of like a nectarine. Just every time I just get a whiff of it. Ooh, hot. Ooh. <laughs> I should have cooled this one down. Oh, that is so good. The same thing that I said about the smell of a nectarine is also the same taste I'm getting with that familiar green tea taste. This is absolutely delicious. I'm thinking right now, Stash is in the lead. 
Yum yum stash. So the last one is the one that came in a little cute pack, T Lyra. And Talira is medium caffeinated. I have it in here now. And let's tip it over just a little bit so you guys can see it. Oh, so hot. Pray for me. Um, it's, it's just one of my favorite tastes that I love. I love a strong, dark tea that um, just, just no fancy bells and whistles, just a simple tea that is absolutely delicious. I love Talera. Um, but once again, I don't know, it feels like lately I've been choosing a lot of green teas, but this is second runner up, Talera. Definitely second runner up. First place, hands down, goes to Stash because I love that hint of nectarine and I also love that familiar taste of green tea. It is absolutely delicious. All of them were good. Of course, I'm not a fan of the berry flavored tea and um, that's okay. That is the fun thing about it. You're just receiving all these different things depending on how you do your profile on the website to determine what type of teas that they send that they can curate that they feel will be right for you. So if you don't like it, then hey, next time just say leave that particular flavor out. But don't stop getting that monthly subscription because it is so fun to have these new and interesting teas to come in the mail. Well, guys, that is it for today. I am going to go ahead and finish up my tea. I hope that you all enjoyed this October unboxing of Sip Spy, and I have all the information down below in the description box to get you guys signed up. And if you are already signed up for Sip Spy, comment down below your experience with the company. And I will see you all next month with more tea. Guys, enjoy the rest of your week, and I will talk to you again soon. Bye.